Welcome back to another round of uh, cash day season. I don't know. We, we got three already. We we hosted three, two OD, one me, and this is an OD created one. I got a couple people for him, but we got about 21 people here. So you know, it's only the third event of the year, and we're already doing pretty good, pretty solid, if you ask me. So OD and fast lane Hamp. Then we got Warned Warrior and Chancellor. We got Sosa and Dolph. Ty and Plumsy, but that one has moved down to last because uh, Plumsy's pulling up. So then we got Vic and Verse, Ghost and Tay, Morg and Danny, me and uh, one of the OGs, Havoc. It's gonna be a good one. Um, have it. And then Country and Yoshi, that's an OG race too. And then last is Zento and Tank, since Zento's pulling up. So let's get OD and uh, and Fast Lane Hamp up there, and then we'll see. First race of the night, we got OD and Fastlane Hamp. Hamp was in that new, uh, I don't know what it is, but it's not fast. Uh, I don't know what he was thinking, bringing it to a cash days, but Murder Nova just killed and made his pass and easily goes through the next round. Next up is Warren and Chancellor. Chancellor's in the D2 and Camaro that we're testing setups out for that and the CTSV. So let's see how it does. Warren was sleeping on the tree, Chancellor gets out on them, and it's over from there. You pretty much have to get out and launch with that Camaro to make it a race. That's what me and him were testing. Sosa, him, and Ty were testing the whole night, trying to find setups for these cars to make the community a little more different, so shout out to them. Next up, we got Dolph in his Hellfire and Sosa in that tuned CTSV. Um, we're trying to find a good tune for it, so let's see if it's uh, worthy of it. Dolph still needs to get used to this uh, racing. He kind of took off pretty solid. I don't know if he had boost or not, but um, Sosa just took off on him. That setup is big tire worthy. You just have to get a good race on with him. So it was it was pretty even. You just got to get out. Vic and Verse, two Mustangs, both red. Um, all I got to say is I got money on the red one. Vic's second event, and he's not doing too bad. You know, he launches out with him. I think he missed a double clutch is what it looks like, and Verse pulls around him. But Verse has been moving that Mustang, so it's going to be tough with him warming up and keep on making solid passes like that, and he's going to get it. Next up is Ghost and Tay. Tay in a Nova, Ghost in a Hellfire. Not our Tay J, but another Tay, newer guy. So let's see what they both got. Ghost grannies it off the line. With the Nova, you should get out on the Hellfire ten or nine times out of ten. Uh, yeah, you should just treat the Hellfire and he should pull around you. Or if you have good top end, then you could keep it. But Ghost made a solid hit and he's moving on to the next round. Danny and Morg, um, two OGs. Morg and his Mustang, Danny and Orange Crush. Danny got that thing moving and hopefully Morg got something to say about it. Solid race, both lead together, but when they go for boost, again, Morg fails to hit it. Just like last cash days, um, Morg was struggling with that Mustang. I know he makes solid test hits with it, but when it comes to it, Morg, you gotta hit your boost, bro. Uh, next up is me and Havoc. I'm in the Mustang, and he's also in the Mustang. I'm testing it out and see what I can do with it. So let's just see what I can get out of this thing. I take off on him, get him off the 60 by about maybe a car, and uh, I hit boost. He didn't. That's pretty much the story on that one. 
Uh, I get the win. I move on. If you know how to drive the Mustang, that thing can take out a Hellfire. Could take out pretty much any big tire if you know how to drive it, you know. So uh, I'm getting it moving. I'm trying to, trying to find setups for other people to use it. Last race of first round is Plumsy and Ty. It should be a good one, a Hellfire and a Mustang. Hopefully Plumsy can take out this Hellfire. With the Mustangs, you gotta always get out on the Hellfire or Nova, and he didn't do that. Uh, they launched together. Ty hit his boost. I don't know if Plumsy did, but he hit his boost and he just drove out of his life. So it is what it is. Um, but we're going on to second round. First is Chance and Ty. Chancellor in that new Camaro detuned and Ty in the Hellfire. They're buddies, they test all the time. So it should be a close one. They both leave together. It's a 50-50 race until the double clutch comes up. And then, you know, Chances has a little bit more juice than Ty does. But he was pulling back, if you can see. He barely lost by a car, car and a half. Um, and, you know, we still need to see more of these detuned cars. Like this next round, this next race, it's me and Sosa and his CTSV. So I finally get to race one of these detuned cars and see what they're all about. And see if they're worthy on showing up to all these cash days that we got planned coming up. I was really looking forward to running and racing this car, but my tree just got him. He was sleeping a little bit and I got the win by bus length. I still, I wanted a heads up race with SCTSV to be honest, I really did. I wanted to test these cars, but we're doing more testing, so it's okay. Next up is Verse and Ghost. Um, two new guys uh, still getting their groove into the community and Verse has been moving that Mustang. So let's see what it does. Verse just had to make an A to B pass. Ghost spun the tires. If Ghost would have just, you know, did his thing, he would have probably took that dub over the Mustang. But Verse, you know, getting that thing dialed down, he's uh, he's getting it moving. So shout out to him. Next up is Country and Fire. Fire, another new guy. He's in the GTR. I wouldn't suggest that for a big tire. Maybe the LG Retro. But Country should have this in the bag. If he doesn't, then I don't know what to say. Kobe still needs to learn all these new rules, all the rules for the double clutch community. Um, he spins the wheels and he still needs to get a groove on racing because, you know, this is this is new to him. And I get it. You know, everyone's been there. Everyone, you know, you see Sosa and Chancellor and Ty. They used to be like a little iffy. But now if you match up against them, they're heavy hitters. But next up is OD and Danny, two Novas. The murder Nova's been struggling lately, so he got to get a groove on it. I don't know what it is with the Murder Nova, but that orange crush is his kryptonite. He can never get past that man. And Danny makes his solid hit. You know, that Nova is moving. When I think of Nova and Double Click Community, it's Danny. And, uh, you know, that's that's just what he drives. Next up is me and Chancellor. I got another chance at a detuned car for the next round. And I just hope, hope he doesn't sleep because I want to run a detuned car. I get what I wanted. I got a race. I was out by like the car or two, but the boost wants to just blow up in my face and he drives around me like it's nothing. So I couldn't really clarify about the car, you know. It fucking sucks, but we'll be back. And Chancellor moves on. Next up is Country and Tank. Tank got two buys. He got the competition buy in the first round and he got the buy in the second. So he's bound to race somebody and that happens to be Country's Imperator. Tank surprised me on that tree. He left the country, and I don't know if he hit double clutch completely, but it looks like he didn't. He just fell back, and country just moves A to B pass. Um, so next up is uh, Danny and Verse. Last race of the third round. You know, Verse in that Mustang. I've been saying it all video. He's moving, but Danny in the orange crush is on another level as well. 
He's a heavy hitter and he's maybe top dog. Don't know what happened to Verse there. I don't know if he spun or he slept, but uh, he just didn't really do well. And Danny ran his race. He gets the dub by about two. And uh, for the next round is Danny and Chancellor. Country got the bye. Winner of this faces uh, Country in the final. Uh, Detun Camaro against Danny's Nova. If there's one person that's going to beat the Camaro, it's Danny. And you know he's not going to lift up on anything. He'll send that car flying. This was the best race of the night. I wish I got a little closer to the finish line to see, but Chancellor took the dub. They were neck and neck all race. And that's how you know, that's a good tune-up for that Camaro. I have all the tune-ups posted in my story. So if you want to run that Camaro, tune it up like that. And obviously we're gonna check you if, you know, if you're running hot, but we'll see about that. Um, Chance and Country in the final. I hope it's gonna be a good one. and. You know, I want to see that Imperator against the Camaro. We've been doing this for about, what, four to five years. Remember when you're on the line, it means you're ready. You have five Mississippis on the line. And that's how Yoshi lost first round to country as well. You know, he got timed out. That's why I didn't even post that one because I didn't want to edit that. But it's five seconds, five Mississippis. If you're on the line, that means you are ready to go. If you need to fix your audio or people are talking on the line, like reverse off the line. Don't turn your lights on. Don't be on that line unless you are ready to race and ready to go because you're going to get timed out. That's why Yoshi got pissed off. He was on the line when Country timed him out and he had so much time and it was just terrible. So if you line up, both cars are on the line. Be prepared. Five Mississippis is when you got to go. And if you get timed out, that's not my problem. You got to learn how to stage quick. So country, congratulations. He won two races off a timeout. Uh, it is what it is. You know, he doesn't like to win like that, but it is what it is. I hope you guys enjoyed. I don't know what I'm where I'm going with these series. We're just doing cash days, having fun. But I got a lot planned. We got MPK, War in the Woods, possibly. Maybe a medium tire list on old gen, but I'm going to focus on the new gen list soon. The big tire list and I got people for that. So hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you in the next one and stay tuned for what's coming.